biggest one. I save after you know the 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 Nostra Adams peanut butter uh, will separate so I'll skim off the top and then we'll usually add it back in as we need it but usually I'm left with a lot of leftover and then we fry in that so it kind of works out really well because we don't fry that often cooking tip if you add a kernel of popcorn it pops at 350 degrees which is usually frying temperature Okay, so had to go to the Asian market for these. The regular store didn't have them. They were like three something. I bought two freeze ones so we can do this later because seriously, this recipe sounds amazing. Thank you to someone on the channel. I apologize, I don't remember your name off the top of my head, who suggested egg rolls for our. So I have one of Willow Creek's eggs here, and we are going to see if it's fertilized. See it, can you? Oh, oh, I... Tell me in the comments if you can see the bullseye. I bought an egg, an egg incubator. I was hoping it would come today. So I'm gonna try and incubate and hatch out our own Willow Creek Homestead eggs. That'll be so fun. The incubator holds 24, and I can only have seven. But I'm gonna push eight, maybe 10. We'll see. I'm gonna build a Wholesome Roots chicken chapter. So, stay tuned. Let's get these egg rolls made. I used to make these, 
but they're just so flipping hard to make and get thin that I thought it wasn't worth it. Okay, I gotta remember, it's been so long since I've made these. Uh, this side? Maybe I should look up a tutorial before I try and show you guys this. Okay. Oh, look at that. How do you like it? Jack, do you like it? Eat your egg roll. This is what Jack is. Well, I think this recipe was a win. Uh, all 32 egg rolls were used all the stuffing for it, so there was no leftover little bits and pieces. Lots of veggies in this. I was surprised that there was only two cups of meat to feed this whole family dinner, so that's a win for less meat. We can grow the bean sprouts, we can grow the cabbage, we can grow the carrots. We did grow the green onions and the garlic. And but we didn't grow the flower yet. Yeah, we didn't grow the flower. We could grow the eggs. The egg came from Willow Creek Homestead. So this is a win dinner. Win dinner. Dinner win. Um, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this. I hope you make this recipe. I'll leave it down in the description. Stay awesome, guys. Grow something today. Even if it's yourself. Uh -oh. Woo, ha, no. <laughs> These are Egyptian waffle onions. Kind of like a perennial green onion. And eventually if you leave it, the tops will make a nice little hole for you that you can pick off and plant. And then your patch will spread. Pretty awesome. How about instead of Egyptian walking onions, we call them Egyptian friendship onions. Because you share the tops with your friends so that they can have a nice patch.